why have a garden? So first of all, we should have a garden because it promotes good nutrition. Um, food that's grown in the garden doesn't have any pesticides because um, we grow it ourselves. We make sure that we're um, only using natural products uh, with our garden. Also, um, pesticides have a lot of negative health consequences. Um, pesticides aren't natural. Um, a lot of times they're chemically processed and um, ultimately have negative consequences. Uh, first of all, um, the food you find in supermarkets usually travels uh, like really far from um, other countries and other countries by a uh, train, boat, airplane, uh, you name it, and uh, which releases more greenhouse gases into the atmosphere and also uh, burns a lot of fossil fuels, whereas um, garden, all it takes is a few steps to your backyard um, and it's as local as it gets. A lot of times pesticides used in commercial forms contaminate the local groundwater. Um, which can be consumed and then is ultimately bad not only for the environment but also for our bodies. Um, it can sometimes run into the drinking water as well and uh, we don't want pesticides in our drinking water. Uh, and also you don't have to pay for the food that you grow yourself um, except for of course the seedlings and seeds that you can buy um, for a pretty cheap price um, but otherwise it can save you a lot of money at the supermarket um, instead of having to buy tomatoes or herbs uh, every week or every month, you uh, get them for free right from your backyard. Also, it's not really supported by our research, but I'm pretty sure it tastes better. One year ago, we traveled to Addison Trail High School to learn from the example of their ongoing successful garden, which has been growing for the past three years. After a meeting with the garden supervisor, we headed out to see it for ourselves. We then headed back to kickstart our own garden. Finally, at the end of May, when the weather was right, we got to work. With some help from the buildings and ground staff, we set up raised beds, planted our seedlings, and watched our herbs grow. The lunch ladies were as enthusiastic about it as we were, and gladly used the herbs in the school's lunches, making the food healthier for the entire student body.